I act a fool when I go and perform, but I'm trying. What the fuck is he doing? Act like a groupie around me, he's drawing. I told him to. And I need me to do. If I ain't get paid, I ain't doing the show. Shit, I'm finna. This is gonna be a little video on dating apps, bro, because <clears throat> I'm gonna keep it 100 with y'all, man. Like, you're not gonna always feel like leaving the crib. You're not gonna, even if you got a car and you don't, like, even if you got a car, you still might not leave the crib. You feel what I'm saying? A lot of people, they got work, they got businesses, they got jobs. You feel what I'm saying? And a lot of people, they just don't feel like leaving the crib. So what I'm going to do in this video is this going to be a top three dating apps that I personally be using. Now, if you got some other options, you know, please feel free to drop those apps down below for me and for other people viewing this video. But uh, we're going to jump straight into this family. It's your boy, Will. And, and this channel, we talking about dating and social skills alone, man. Like, and also, like, you know, just vlogs whenever I feel like doing a daily vlog, man. If you ain't check out my other channel, go check out my other channel. Willard Baheem, you know what I'm saying? That's my spiritual channel. And that's how, you know what I'm saying, we rocking over there. But right now, we just going to talk about social skills, you know what I'm saying? And I feel personally like my, my number one app that I use, I'm not saying it's the best, you know what I'm saying? These are my top three right now, and I honestly feel like they're not even do, producing that much for me, but like, these are my top three. Number one is Bumble, you know what I'm saying? Bumble, I feel like is a good dating app, you know what I'm saying? Uh, it's good for friendships and dating. You know, I always talk about how building your social life in general is good because women are going to flop. You know what I'm saying? Like, women are connected to people. So, like, for instance, like, there's a thing called, like, um, what you call it? Uh, social circle game. And, like, um, what do you call it? Uh, yeah, I guess a social circle game is, like, if if, 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 if a number of y'all think about the, the females that y'all had in y'all life before y'all had... Um, got older like most of the females that y'all was dating was females that were like in your social group like pair groups and stuff like that like so like you'll have like your friend or your two friends or three friends or whatever your amigos you feel me and then what will happen right it'll be a female that'll come into that group of of men and then that female will kind of sniff out the guys that she found most attractive so the luxury of being on Bumble and the second app that I'm going to tell you is that females, you know what I'm saying? You could you could go to the dating side of Bumble or you could just stay on the friendship side. And either way it go, when you build your friend groups, you're going to automatically, uh, consequently, you know what I'm saying, go out with those friends to bars, movies, you know what I'm saying, to eat and just do stuff with the homies. And then it's going to automatically snow pile into more relationships with women, you know, and it's Saturday right now, I mean, I, I'm, I'm, I'm chilling, you know, on my, on my lonely, but I definitely had a friend I could have linked up with, and I met them off of Bumble, I'm not gonna lie, so that's, that's dating app number one, we're gonna slide straight to dating app number two, and this one, this shit become, as no surprise, I can't even talk, bro, my language is just bad, this shit even come as no surprise, you know, number two is just gonna be, uh, Facebook dating, you know what I'm saying? Facebook dating, bro. Uh, Facebook dating, my cousin actually put me onto that a while ago. Everybody's success is different up there, but you will uh, get a lot of swipes at first, a lot of matches. There's a lot of females, you know what I'm saying, from your city, from your town. So it's more personal. These, these females going to feel like they kind of know you, you know what I'm saying? Not know you, but they're going to feel like, a you know, more rapport because it's like, oh, well, he kind of like... Either they seen you before or they maybe they haven't, but it's their first time to see you. I also want to add the tip that y'all should be fly. You know what I'm saying? Like, like what I got on right now, I got on jeans. I got on regular shoes, bro. Like, 
I'm not fly right now to me, but I'm fly enough to go to like a club or something and just like, you know, I got on two hoodies. So it's like, that's the only thing messing it up, but I could take one hoodie off. But I'm saying like, I could go anywhere really right now. It's Saturday, uh, clubs, bars, um, restaurants. All I got to do is take one of these hoodies off and I'm going to be straight. You know what I'm saying? So uh, I'm also going to start rating outfits on this channel. Like uh, for people who come to this channel and y'all want to get your outfits rated, you know what I'm saying? Y'all could get my Instagram and DM me photos. Or I could rate y'all profiles too because like I'm, I'm going to start rating Instagram profiles just to show like, you know what I'm saying y'all can clean up y'all profiles, do this, do that, and the third. Uh, because like I was just about to say, like um, uh, on Facebook and on Bumble and on the third thing that I'm gonna tell y'all, like bro, like a lot of times I don't get a lot of matches because I don't got like I got my photos is like a six out of ten. Like you know what I'm saying I got friends that's photographers and stuff like that, but. I don't really take a lot of photos, bro. I don't really be at a lot of events, parties, and going out to eat like I used to when I was younger. So, like, I used to just, like, have people with me when I used to go out to eat. Just, like, hey, take this photo real quick. Take this photo. It needs to be sunny days outside and stuff. Like, bro, like, just, like, that's why I say, like, Bumble is the perfect app because it's, like, you're meeting friends. Like, like women want guys who have a life, you know what I'm saying? I'm not even going to hold y'all. Just me being, you know, part-time dating coach, like, Women want guys who have a life. Like, I'm not even going to lie. Like, that's, like, one of the main attractive things you could have. So, it's, like, Bumble is probably the number one dating app in my mind right now. And then Facebook is kind of connected to your Facebook account. So, it's, like, that's also another way to, you know, flaunt your, you know, lifestyle or whatever. And then what was my third option, though? I got Facebook and Bumble. And then I think third was Meet Me. And I know my my options are unconventional. I know my options are just weird and just different. That's why I tell y'all, drop y'all down below so I can check it out for myself and download it and check it out for myself. But it's not where you at. It's what you do with the matches. that. I this bonus tip that I'm going to give y'all at the end of this video is just... I gave y'all my three. Meet me is good because meet me, you can go live with women when you first meet them. You could go on dang near dates, you know what I'm saying? And they give you women in the tri-state areas. They give you women, you know, as far as you want. But you can just get on, meet me, and just, like, find a... Like, I can find women, like, in my little neighborhood and around, you know what I'm saying, my town and then, like, the tri-state areas, which is, means the three nearest states over in... I could just talk to women and just, you know, I could hop in their live and tell them, hey, put up the dating app. And, I mean, put up the dating box, you know, and a little box pop up and I could go, I could talk to these women for like 30 seconds over and over and over and over again, like repetitively. And then they could put the permanent thing up once we form a, a relationship or a bond. You know what I'm saying? And then you can tell those women to click on your profile and DM you or follow you or favorite you. And then you could lead them that way towards the phone number, clothes, and all that stuff. So, now that I got those three out the way, I just want to get these last bonus tips, which was like, like I said, number one would be uh, dress to your best abilities. Like, you know, I look bummy right now, but it's okay. Uh, dress to your best abilities. Try to do that at least like... On Wednesday, just ask yourself, like, yo, how am I doing with this? Like, am I dressing under or above my expectations? You see what I'm saying? Uh, you don't have to be the, have all the clothes in the world. You know, you just got to ask yourself that. Um, try to get haircuts. You know, I got this on my head, so I don't really... Uh, it, ain't that, it ain't that, though. Like, I still got to, on the 1st and the 15th, you know what I'm saying? Just get a lineup or something. Shave your beard up or something. Um... So that's tip number one. Tip number two, like I said, when you start making friends, somebody going to have to be your wingman and they're going to have to take photos of you, bro. That's just how the game go. And people don't mind doing that, bro. Even if you ask your mom, like, yo, mom, take this photo real quick. Like, it ain't, you know what I'm saying? You could sneak sometimes, do unconven unconventional people just had to take your photo. They might get on your nerves real quick, but just had to take your photo real quick. You know what I'm saying? You can have your 
cousins, little cousins, little niece, nephew. You know, you can have whoever's around you take your photo real quick and then just take, tell them, click it as many times as possible. You do a little bit of poses and you get out of there, bro. And then pick the best one, you know, and then when you pick the best one, upload it on every social media app. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, we got to start making moves, bro. That's why I'm making this video, bro. And then the last tip would be after you know how to dress, you get in your hair, you're touching your hair up twice a month at least, you're having your photos taken, um, you should be good to go. Uh, the last thing would be to make your profile edible, you know what I'm saying? When, and that's for Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, it's all platforms. Your, your, Insta, um, your profiles should have a, a very descriptive or just cocky um, bio. You know what I'm saying? That's the most important thing when it comes to the profile, in my opinion. And then you should have a, a cool profile picture. I don't got the best ones. I'm just giving y'all the game because I'm going to I'm gonna fix up all my stuff too. Like, um, But again, even if you do everything I'm telling you, every woman is not going to respond to your DM. Every woman is not going to chase you. But that's not what we need. We don't need every woman to do it. We just need to take baby steps in the right direction so that after a while, we're, it's all about the snowball effect. You feel what I'm saying? So... These are my three top dating apps, you feel me, for men, you know what I'm saying, for all people just to get on, get get out here and gain some experience with it, but y'all let me know down below what's y'all top three dating apps, you know what I'm saying, and at the end of the day, I'm looking for new ones, I ain't gonna lie, like at least one or two, you know what I'm saying, because Facebook to me ain't really considered like a dating app, I don't see it as that. And yeah, the other two are dating apps, but those are just my little, I, I, I see those more as like my little secrets in the cut. I just gave y'all my secret ones, like, but like, I feel like dating apps are more like Hinge, Tinder and stuff like that. But, you know, I feel like if you get on those type of apps, you got to be good at, um, like I said, your bio got to be hooked up and your, fo your photos got to be together. And if that's not the case, you're going to stop. They're not going to let you match with a lot of females. I'm just going to tell you that right now. Like, they're going to start you off matching, but then they're going to stop it. You feel me? After like a month in, two weeks in, you ain't going to be matching with no females. You feel me? They ain't going to let you match. So it's going to be crazy, bro. You're just going to be sitting there wasting your time. You know what I'm saying? Especially if you don't got no money, so you don't pay for like the the leveling up and all that stuff. You know, if you pay for all that stuff, then you could get a lot of matches. I'm not going to lie, but... That's why I gave y'all my unconvent um unconventional. I'm I'm gonna name that this three my favorite three unconventional dating apps. And man, look, man. Hopefully, y'all like this video. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, man. It's your boy Willer coming at y'all with that heat, man. Listen, man. More to come, man. See y'all in the next video, man. I'm out.